Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's regularly scheduled meeting of the uh, Sunderland Board of Selectmen. It's May 1st, 2017. Call to order at uh, 6.43. Uh, Scott will not be joining us this evening. He had a previous engagement that he could not miss. So that being said, we had town, uh, we had town meeting was Friday evening. We got through the, uh, all the warrant articles. I'd like to thank everybody that took the opportunity to come uh, and participate in a very unique New England-y type of thing, a town meeting. You're not going to find that town, that form of government in many other places besides uh, New England. So I'd like to, uh, again, thank everybody for coming, expressing their point of view, um, also having good dialogue. Um, and it's important. The dialogue is important so that we can keep our town moving forward in the right way. Uh, we do have a budget. It's contingent upon a prop two and a half override vote, and that vote will be taking place at on Saturday, this coming Saturday, May sixth, from eight a.m. to three p.m. at the Sunderland Elementary School on Swampfield Road. On Swampfield Road, so. I encourage everyone to vote. Our first item is Old Business Board of Selectmen updates. David? I have no updates this week. All <laughs> right. Um, week other than the meeting. Town meeting overview. David? Um, you want to do an overview of that? Or? Well, that's, well. I, I would say my 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 biggest thing of of, of the uh, town meeting is I appreciate all of the number of people that showed up. Um, FCAT still working out the bugs with uh, the sound. The issue. sound um, that's been a problem for every year that we've been there. Um, so we're going on twenty plus years. Yeah, it's a t it's a tough room for the acoustics and everything. So we'll keep we'll keep working at it. Um, I don't know what what other options that we have, um, but we'll talk. We'll um, apologize. We apologize for the parking. Uh, there appeared to be a soccer game or soccer practice plus a softball game that was going mm -hmm. on. Sherry's going to be emailing um, the the principal at Sunderland Elementary. Plus our rec committee that, uh, and maybe we'll put some signs up uh, that they're, we're going to try next year's town meeting, which we already know the date of because we're the first or the last, the last Friday in April. We're <clears throat> going to uh, um, send out an email to those that are involved right now so that we won't have that problem next year. Yeah, they had also. a softball game there on Merritt Field, too, which was nice to see. Yeah. Other than the parking issues. Other than parking. <laughs> so, so we'll we'll try to work on on that. That was something that we didn't know was going on, and it may have to had it may have dealt with the fact that it had been raining, so it may have been postponement and stuff. So that's true. We don't know, um, but we'll try to make sure that it's not scheduled for uh, Thursday or Friday evening next year, because typically they don't have Friday evening softball games, so yeah. it must have been postponed. But anyways. <laughs> Um, so that was, we'll try to get that. We'll do better on that. Um, I, th I think, um, apologize, there was a little uh, misunderstanding with, with the, the uh, data that was held up by at the front table. Our data was, our, one of our handouts was not current. Um, so after we got that, that taken care of, we went, went okay. Yeah. Um, I think maybe next year, if we pop the, the handouts like online a little earlier too, that way people have a chance to look through it, you know, before they get there, that'll help too, I think. Then but can come I, again, questions. I thought that it was, it was um, it's a good turnout. Excellent turnout. Um, and we'll be moving forward then. Um, town administrator updates, Sherry? Um, a couple. We locked in at $1.90 a gallon for oil. 
Yeah, we got notice today, and we submitted the complete streets um, grant Eyes project up. request. Yeah. So um, that's up, and I guess it'll be a couple months before we hear. But we have about three hundred and ninety-six thousand dollars worth of projects that we submitted. So. That'll be good. Yeah. Okay. Um, correspondence from the uh, board of assessors. Yes. This is dated April 24th. Dear Board of Selectmen, the Board of Assessors has reviewed the contract from Patriot Properties, Inc. for FY 2018 and FY 2019 interim years. Chris Keith, the proposed project manager, met with the board on Monday, April 10th, 2017 to discuss services that they will provide. The Board of Assessors recommends that the select board sign the contract for $44,000, $22,000 for each year. The Sunderland Water District pays 30% of the cost of our valuation contractors. The current contract we have with Mayflower Valuation ends June 30th, 2017. Our price with them has remained static for almost 12 years at 15,000. Sincerely, the Board of Assessors. Okay, uh, motion to sign? Uh, motion. I'll, I will second. All those, in, well, any discussion? All None those in favor, please four. signify by saying aye. Aye. Uh, Sherry, two zero on that. Um, Appointment of a PBTA representative alternate for this coming tomorrow. Tomorrow. Um, I know I'm not able to uh, to go tomorrow. David, are you? Oh, yeah, I can't make it either. All right. So I don't think Scott is. So right now we'll, we'll we won't okay. be able to have anybody. Um, anything else? Mm -hmm. What are we going to do? We're going to have them going for another first. three hours. <laughs> I'm not used to these short meetings. <laughs> you know, we, we couldn't, it could be, a, I could, it I could, could be allude to the fact that, that Mr. Bergeron's not here. Yeah. <laughs> Again. We have no quote. I know. We have no quote. I, you know, I should have thought of it. I could have brought a quote in for tonight, but. Um. Mm-hmm. All right. So just, just as a, a reminder. Town election is Saturday from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. at the Sunderland Elementary School. The next selectman's meeting is next Monday, which is 5-8-2017. Um, there was questions from the town meeting floor about when the, uh, the 300 uh, the 300th committee met and they meet on the first Thursday of the month so if anybody wants to go to their meeting and and get any additional information or to propose anything to them they will be here this Thursday at 6 p.m. they meet they meet in this room at 6 p.m. so if, they, if you want to come and talk to the uh, um, 300th committee, they will be here this coming Thursday night at 6. Anything else? All right, That's I just it. wish to thank, again, thank everybody for coming to the town meeting. Also, the uh, um, annual elections are taking place this Saturday, and I would encourage you to uh, to go to the polls and vote. Um, it's, it's funny, we have American soldiers all over the world um, fighting for the right to vote for fighting other for mm -hmm. others so they could have the right to vote so um, I think if you want to re help respect those men and women it would be a it'd be an appropriate to vote if you have the opportunity to do so that's usually pretty quick too and you get to run into some neighbors maybe that you don't see all the time anyway. Correct. so anything else baby I think that's it okay motion uh, motion to adjourn. We have a motion to adjourn. I will second. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. We will declare ourselves out at uh, 652. Thank you. Thanks, F. Kent. Just seems wrong.